riveted. Okay, this is the official start. Um, to recap what happened l in last episode, uh, Mia pretty much killed me with the chainsaw. And on mode, I died out like a punk, basically, because I'm not used to this game with the first person perspective. I'm very, very much a noob at this. Um, I died, to be fair, I died when I played Resident Evil 4 a bunch of times the first time I played that too, because it, it's kind of a similar type, sort of thing, um, uh, where Resident Evil 4 changed how Re Resident Evil did. Then after that, I got taken out by Walter White. Walter White knocked me out, he said, welcome to the family, son. Then he knocked me out. Then it, we had, like, a cannibal Texas Chainsaw Massacre type meal. They force-fed me some intestines I think yeah and then uh, after that I managed to escape but then Walter White got angry at me um, and then he chased after me and for the longest time I looked for like 10-15 minutes and I thought I had to die in order to get to the next part because I was looking for the keys I could not find the keys for the life of me and ironically the keys this is a funny placement. The keys is where you find Walter White with the with the shovel, and you don't you know. So that's a good placement because you don't you wouldn't think of it that it would be there because you're trying to run from them. Um, but it took me forever, and I took like 50 shovel hits and like 50 knees before I actually actually died and figured out that wasn't the way I was supposed to go. And eventually, I did find the keys. I got to the porch thing, got up to the safe haven. This is classic Resident Evil. If you remember the originals, this would be a safe haven. Like in the original remake, they had the safe haven music and Resident Evil 2 or 3. This is basically where your safe spot is. You've got your stuff to store store your stuff in here. It's classic Resident Evil. It's an email from Mia. Oh, this is stuff to store. Got the driver's license and the... Got chem fluid. Mix that with, with the herb to make first aid med. But yeah, so that's where we left off last time. Um, I got the main house map now. Am I supposed to? Oh, I got it. Okay, good. Now, I have no idea... It's like a, I thought that was a naked lady on her side, to be honest, but it's actually an eagle. So it's just, just, yeah, it's like an eagle on the side. Like if you look at it this way, you're like, yeah, it's a bird, obviously. But if you look at it this way, you know the, the head of the yeah, oh girl, naked bird loveliness. Um, <laughs> anyways. I take I take that back, but I'm guessing this might be like the BSAA emblems in Resident Evil 5. I'm guessing it might be like that where you have to collect them. That's just my guess. Like I said, I'm playing this blind, so I have no idea. Let's see what the the new map. Oh, I'm in the laundry room. Man, I hope one day that laundry will be automatic, kind of like a dishwasher, where you put the clothes in. And it washes it, and it dries it, and then you just pull it out. Closet type setup. Yeah, but washing machine. Yeah, yeah, I'm talking with Michelle now. Um, that ones that you. Ah, uh, oh, here we go. Ah, I got a lock pick. That's right. Getting ready to shank some people. Some, um, shank some zombies. Well, not zombies, but the infected. Family, you know what I mean. I mean, I hope you know what I mean. Anyways, but yeah, um, ones where you don't have to transfer it from the washer to the dryer. It's like an all-in-one, kind of like the all-in-one computers nowadays, where you have in the old days that so you have to have the tower and the monitor. Yeah, back in my day, we didn't have to. I'm not going back here. No, uh, no. Uh, so one's calling on the phone. It's Morpheus again. Yo. You did good, Ethan. Zoe, right? I mean, what the fuck are you? Shut up and listen if you want to stay alive. You gotta get out of that house. 
Got a key down. I feel the after the meat hall. And that thing on your wrist is a codex. Don't lose it. It's important. Whoa, I got a Frankenstein arm. It's like totally bolted on. Hell of a girl. Okay. They really stink, this socks. Okay. See, oh, I don't think I've gone up here, have I? Let's see. I know I'm gonna be bugging the hell out of people, like looking thoroughly, but that's the kind of player I am. Just in case, I'm gonna save again. Yep. So, so is helping me. I I could I I've got the headphones on, so I I can hear. So I can hear like her talking, but I can't. Sometimes it's muffled, so I can't make out what she's saying. Let's see. Is there a door? There we go. It's a door next to the lockpick. Some bange. There we go. You unlocked it. The lockpick I just got. Do I have any kind of weapons at all? I have none. Thought I had something. Did I have at least... Shoot, I thought I had a handgun. Okay, I am so screwed. They're gonna pop up out of nowhere. I think this game is quite possibly the scariest game since uh, the original Resident Evil. Maybe even scarier. Now you think that would heal up my stitches as well, but no, nope, no, it doesn't. Okay, the old lady is still here. No, so yeah, this was the meal. Looks like a bunch of intestines here. I'm been intestin' you. Oh, anyways, that was a stupid pun. All right, check in there. I know something's gonna. That's the scariest thing. Like when Mia popped up. Every time she pops up, except for the basement scene, I knew that was coming. I knew it was. I knew the basement scene was coming up, so I wasn't surprised by I the way it happened. I was surprised, but the fact that something did happen, I was not surprised by that. But it's extra creepy her climbing climbing up the stairs like that. But then when she came up from the side, like out of nowhere, before Walter White showed up, I uh, that that came out of nowhere, and that really had me going. Can't use this, no. Garage, no, I can't do that. There was something that was locked, I think. And I know someone's bound to come up eventually. I am gonna be screwed when that does happen. I'm gonna be so screwed, okay. Well, if it happens, I'll just go down to the hatch again, back to the safe area. And that's that's what this great they set this atmosphere up where you it's so quiet eerily quiet like the calm before the storm and then something pops up when you least hey you you better be a good guy I swear to shank you hey, hey you gotta help me Hold on, back up. Now. he's gonna die he is gonna get killed what me no no be another one you're about to be another missing person go get help send in harmony send in chuck norris the army send in the army send in chuck norris jet lee bruce lee well not bruce lee rest rest in peace uh send in send in chuck norris send in send in all the all the good guys just go just go you stupid, stupid fool. Hey, wait. You gotta give me your gun. <laughs> you must have lost your mind. Look, officer. Deputy. Right. Deputy. Now, you wanna see my name in the obituaries? But you wanna be a hero and save my life. Just go and get Chuck Norris. 
fucking pocket knife? I got a pocket knife. Take it. Yay. Now go to the garage. Now. Garage. Okay. I'm gonna go to the garage. What am I gonna do okay. with Okay. Oh, I'm gonna shank some of the fuckers. Okay. Now the garage, if I remember right, is down this way. I'm terrible with sense of direction. I really am. I swear I, I'm terrible. Oh, the garage is over here, you fool. Something's gonna pop up, I guarantee you, though. Break this shit open. There we go, handgun ammo. Good. This is like the old... Old Resident Evil, like, 4 and 5 knives, only worse. This thing is a small pig sticker. I guarantee that cop guy is gone, though. He should have sent in re reinforcements. Chuck Norris could be right here and he would just settle it with his beard. Oh, I know the scene. I've seen the scene in the trailer. Me? What about you? It's my job. Won't you do your job and tell me? Answer my questions. Yep. Send in reinforcements. Yep, he's gone. Wow. Ouch. Where's your gun? I'm gonna kill every one of you. You kill me, and I just go right on back. Walter White's mad at me again. Okay. Come on. Where? My girlfriend's over here saying she's gonna have nightmares. This is not the scariest part either. Thank you, baby. There we go, I got in the car. Got the keys going. Yeah. <laughs> yep. I get to run this guy over many times. This is awesome. Kind of ironic. Michelle just got her driver's license, so this is ironic. Look, Michelle. Yeah, check, check it out. Don't trust it. This is typical horror movie stuff right now. Something pulled it off. Yep. Wow. I can't imagine what this must be like in VR. I don't know if I'd ever be brave enough. Okay. One day, if I ever do really great, you know, and if you guys really want to, I'll do it. Right now, I just don't have the budget. But maybe... Oh, shoot. Did I die? Is that a thing? Did I just die? Okay, no. I've got hurt really bad. Okay, Walter White seriously just got me messed up now. Get the gun. Is there a gun? Please give me give me a gun. Okay. Yeah, I got the handgun. Good. I'm going to need this. I know I will. I'm going to need this so bad. I remember this straight from the trailer. He's going to come up at me. This man is on fire. Burn, baby, burn. Okay. I know he's going to come back. Reload. Reload. Always reload it when you can. Okay. What the hell do I do from here? Where do we go from here? Good. I'm going to need that later for sure. I know I will. Walter White, or temporarily stopped Walter White. There we go, I've got two of these now. How do I move this? 
this stuff. I did not mean to do that. I wasted a one. Darn it. Okay, I'm guessing I'm supposed to go up the ladder. And he's gonna come after- yep, I knew it. Yep, he just made me shoot him in the head to prove a point that he's gonna come back. He's basically Terminator. Terminator Walter White. And he'll be back. Ah, classic emblem. Yep. Yep, classic emblem stuff from Resident Evil. Back in the classic old RE days, you'd have to get all these emblems and keys, and there'd be all these puzzles, and you'd have to figure out and all this crazy stuff. Is this seriously all this left? Wait a minute. There we go. Okay, good. Hopefully Walter White won't come back after me. Come here, Walter White. I'll break you till you're bad. I don't know. That was terrible. Okay. Oh, this place seems familiar. I'm betting you either Walter White shows up or... Or lady. Oh, I remember. I think this one was locked. It's a lock pick. Yes. That's right. Give me more first aid stuff. Okay. Master of unlocking. Yep. Just like Jill. Okie dokie. Something tells me something's gonna pop up again. Where do I go from here? What's the thing? Get out of the house. Get to the main hall. I think this is the main hall. Someone's gonna pop out of the corner. I know it. I know it. Do I have to put one of the emblems in here? Is that what kind of deal this is? I knew it. I called that. It's classic Resident Evil. Now I wonder if I should save it first. Yeah, I'm gonna save it. I'm gonna go. Where's the liner room from here? <coughs> My dog just scared me just <coughs> now. He barked right when I was looking. Right when I was about to go to the corner. <coughs> Louise! I don't know. She's get, to, get to the laundry room. Laundry room is the safe place. You save it just in case if the next part gets too long. Hi, right, Louise. You're a good doggy. Most of the times. The funny, the funny thing is, my Louise, our dog, will bite the, one of the cat's ears, and the cat's like twice her size or bigger, and um. Or bigger, and and, uh, and the cat doesn't do anything except go. Yeah, basically, and uh, you think I mean, you think you would just like give it a swipe or something, but he is laid most laid back cat. And I don't know a lot about cats, but I've heard male cats are like that. They're very laid back and very affectionate. And if you hear that in the background, that is our dog. Whoa! Get the bobblehead. Shoot me! Shoot me! Does it really want me to shoot? This is a thing. I've got this saved, so if something happens. Huh. That's weird. Okay. What is this place? Oh, this is the main hall. 
explore the main hall. Okay. He's here, he's there, he's everywhere. What was that that I just get? What did I just get? Gunpowder that can be packed into bullets combined with chem fluid to create handgun ammo. Holy shit. That's interesting. Okay. So that, another antique coin. Aw, oh, not Morpheus again. Every time I talk to you, Morpheus, something bad happens. I am not the one, Morpheus. That's either Agent Smith or Neo. It's not me. Let's see. Ah, I know where this is going to pay off. There's that other clock. Yeah. It's like I said. I used to play a long time ago. It's been a couple years since I played the original Resident Evils, but I remember that. I remember. How are you doing on time, baby? That's good. Yeah, I, I work the night shift, and it's like around 9.20. I got to leave around like 10 or something. Or not, not 10, like 10, 15. So, part four will be over soon. Uh, let's see what else we got over here. This weird pedestal thing. Oh, no, no, no. Whoa. Oh, I know. You know I would. What is this pedestal about? Is this just to examine stuff? Is this what this is about? Put an unrelated shop on a shadow plant. Oh, it's a shadow one. You have to you have to have a bird one. That's what it is. The bird has to line up just right with it. Okay. I get it. I get it. I know the puzzles. I know the puzzles from old Resident Evil. I, I've played Code Veronica X. I've played... Original Resident Evil, Resident Evil 2, Resident Evil 3. I haven't played the Survivor ones or Revelations. Did my daddy give you a hard time? That's your father? He used to be. Wait, but he, he, he's, a, he's dead now. You just might be able to pull this off. What? Pull what off? There's something I need you to do, but I can't explain it right now. You may need some sort of keys to do it, but find a way out of the house. Okay. I'll be in touch. Okay, and he'd be coming out with that chainsaw again. Welcome home, baby. Oh, shoot. That just scared the bejesus out of me. I thought those scorpions were spiders for a second there. And that freaked me out. Okay, alright. I'm done. I'm done with that door. That door can go go down a deep dark hole and never be seen it from again. Now, should I or shouldn't I? I'm not going to. I can't do it, no. Uh, I know I'm supposed to shoot the bobbleheads. Maybe the bobbleheads are actually like the BSA A emblem type things from Resident Evil 5. Maybe that's the whole deal with those. Because I shot it and then I heard a sound just like, and they're breakable just like the BSA emblems in Resident Evil 5 are. I'm having... Oh, shoot. I'm being watched. I'm being watched by the crank, by the lady. Yes. Yeah, my girlfriend looked at it right at that second. Eveline, May 2nd, 2014. Now, most faces look weird upside down, and so does hers. Okay. My face looks weird upside down, too. It's the eyes. The eyes look freaky when they're upside down. Now, should I try to go through here? I'll check over here first. Nothing? Okay, now, should I... Should I go over here? Or, or this is this is a trap. This is a trap. Stephen Hunt over here. Give me the information. 
Tell me what I need to know. Give it to me. Give me the information, lady. Up. Ah, they did that on purpose. The moment I get close to her, I can't aim. They knew. They knew we would shoot at her. I knew. I know there's something up with you. They wouldn't put you in random places if you weren't important like that. And cryptically just looking. I remember back in my days. We didn't have all these fancy video gamers like you have. Things were so different back then. What happened to the lockpick? The lockpick, you can only have so many uses out of it? What the hell? I think that's what happened. The lockpick's gone. What the hell? The only thing I can think of is either you only have so many uses or it disappeared on... I, I put it in the... When I went to save, I put it in the storage thing by accident. I know something's going to pop up. I know. I know, I know, I know, I know. Shoot. This is just waiting for an ambush here. It's just waiting for an ambush. Okay. What time are we at? Like 9.30 now? 9.37? Debating on whether I should save. Yeah, I'm just going to save. I'm going to... Wait. Yeah, I'm just going to save and play it safe. Oh, thank you guys so much for watching. Please subscribe. If you like this video, please hit like. And if you want to see more videos like this, please subscribe. It would mean so much.